Number 23. For which of the reactions in exercise 1315 does KC, calculated using concentrations, equal KP, calculated using pressures? And then I have one of the balanced equations from that exercise list. So in this case, we have to find out if Br2 gas, which comes to equilibrium with 2Br gas, whether uh, the KC equals the KP. And then I'll put a question mark here. Does it equal it or does it not? We will see. The KC equaling KP only happens when the gas moles of reactants equals the gas moles of the products. So it's very specific. Only look at the gases. But in this case, I have a gas on the left side and I have a gas on the product side. So I'm going to be taking those two uh, substances. Now, how are we going to find out the moles? That's just the coefficients, the big numbers in the front. Here, I only have one Br2. And here, they gave me a 2. So I have 1, and maybe I'll just put a 1, one total mole on my reactant side, and I have two total moles on my product side because I have no other gases on both sides. Since 1 does not equal 2, would Kc equal Kp? The answer is no, because if they equal to each other, the gases have to equal each other. 1 does not equal 2, therefore Kc does not equal Kp. And there you go. Hopefully this helped. Let me know in the comments. Thank you so much for viewing the video. I really hope we're giving you good quality educational content for you guys to study and do well on your tests and quizzes. If you guys are uh, taking physics and math, or if you know anyone who's taking physics and math, go tell us about the channel. We've got tons of uh, physics videos. We've got tons of math videos. We've got more chem videos. We almost have 3,000 videos, which is pretty incredible. So go check it out. All right. Thank you so much, and I will see you in later lessons. Take care. Bye.